Okay, Shalom. I'm gonna give all praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim, Raka Kwadash. Uh, double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone. And Shalom to the elect. Uh, you know, just a quick uh, lesson. I'm on my way to work. And uh, just listen to the apostle uh, Gabar's video. Today's three, I think three, four. Just get up, get into it, get involved. Okay, and now uh, one thing he said in this video is what I'm gonna try to do through the spirit and power of Yahweh Shim Yahweh Shah is to make sure my videos are edifying, you know, because this word is for the elect. All right, and we else coming in the spirit, supposedly coming into the in the spirit, Yahweh Shim Yahweh Shai. All right, that's why we say Ba Hashim Rakakwadash. Okay, your lesson is supposed to be edifying. All right, we do these uh, lessons to reprove, to exhort the Akim, to rebuke, if need be. Okay, and um, to whomever, to whomever, uh, it it applies. But as the scriptures say, in Matthew the seventh chapter, you can't cast the boat out of another brother's eye when you have a beam in your own eye. Okay, so uh, you know, being able to judge. Uh, that's something we should pray for too As you're supposed to judge yourself first Alright Before you can judge others Okay That's what makes you a good judge You know Um Just, just thoughts You know going through my head as I, as I uh, You know watch these le this lesson This beautiful lesson From Apostle Bar. Alright in which we learn from these men you know, so we see the apostles doing good videos, man. It's not like they just, you know, doing it because they feel like they have to, man. They're doing it to edify the elect, in which we all should be doing, man. You know, this is the, you know, this is the uh, year of prophecy, man. So this could be the year where, you know, that multitude comes in, all right? And the multitude, when they come in, they're going to be uh, thirsty, man, for that milk. You know, so it's all the, you know, it's the perfect year to flood the truth. You know, the year of prophecy, and which why we must prophesy. That's why the spirit is amped up for us to do the three videos a week. All right, in the spirit of the three videos a day. All right, because prophets prophesy. The perfection of the Lord, man. You know? And we almost out of here, man. You know, because even, scripture say, when this truth shall go throughout the four corners of the earth, then shall... Uh, the, the income this camps all over the world Jamaica Holland UK I just found a brother over there in Costa Rica man I didn't even know that you know brothers is a brother over there um, I don't know if he's camping yet but his brother over there in DR Dominican Republic uh, Trinidad uh, I believe it's uh, yeah Trinidad um, Guyana all across the world man all right this chip and that's another thing too pray that uh you know the most high uh allows you not to take that chip you know i ponder on that uh, at least i try to ponder on that often is that like brothers always say um you know no matter what you do you can't make yourself of the elect man so it's all through the, the mercies of your how about shimmy how shy like Ephesians the second chapter said, not of works lest any man should boast. Alright, but it's of the will of him that calleth. So you how about Shimia Shai called us into this truth? As as did he. When you read the scriptures like Matthew the fourth chapter, third chapter, you know, when he was getting James and John and um Simon and Andrew, the different apostles coming to the fold. Alright, they dropped what they were doing and they straightway came into the truth, but they were called. You know, they would, it's not like they were, uh, you know, spiritually they were, but they, you know, the scriptures don't say that they were out searching for the Lord, all right? I'm saying physically, all right? The Lord found them, man. The scriptures say, um, is that John 16 and 15? Um, you have not called me, but I have called you. You have not chosen me, but I have chosen you, you know? So, Lord willing, man, you know, we putting our lives on a whole so to speak, you know, your worldly life or whatever. All right, not that it has any value, 
But the thing is, I'm saying, if you're catching hell, all right, you might as well just take it all the way out, man. If it be the Lord's will, you know. You catch your hell for the Lord, you might as well just go all out for it. You know? And, um, yeah, man. Don't take the chip, you know? I like to think about, you know, uh, well, at least I try, but it's a carnal mindset. So then I have, you know, I tell myself, wait, you gotta have faith, man. You know, thinking about how things are gonna be and how you're gonna eat and how you're gonna get around, you know? Because there's gonna come a point where making money is gonna have to stop, you know? There's gonna come a point where this life as you know it is different. You know, you have different trade wars symbolizing a famine. All right, famine of the fool. All right, Esau's messing with the uh, YouTube. All right, um, net neutrality is coming up on the 23rd. That's a famine of the word. All right, then these trade wars is ultimately going to lead to the chip, in which the apostle God uh, Tahar put up the video of how Esau is chipping. All right, everybody, man. You know, I just going to say uh, rich and poor, free and bond. All right. I believe, you know, what well, he, he put up the video of, uh, you know, the, um, the poorest amongst the Indians being chipped. I mean, um, you know, being put into the bi uh, biometric database. All right. Then next, what they're probably going to put on, um, um, it's probably going to be a video of, of where uh, people in jail is going to get um, be put into the biometric database, man. You know, so I don't see this place going past another one, two years, man. You know, Lord willing, we continue. All right. Yeah, how about Shimya was sharp rock now? Barack, yeah, man. Alright, hey, so with that, shalom.